my nap in and it was wonderful. I must say, it started to rain again too while I was napping, so that was just absolutely perfect timing. Now it's time to get supper ready. Um, we are going to warm up this, half of this um, Boston butt that I got from Mike's Meats in Moultrie. It's already smoked and I like that. I love convenience. Need some serration. Serrated. Serrated. That'll work. And I need a cutting board. Okay. So, I'm going to give my mom a little bit. This is smoked. But. Alright. It's fabulous Friday. Fabulous Friday. All right, let's see. Kind of got her a small bag. Mm. My dad is going to adore this. I wonder if you can see it. Let me see if I can get you any closer. That's the pot I'm going to put it in. Ooh, look at there, look at there, look at there. Let me adjust. Okay. So it's cold right now. I just pulled it out of the refrigerator. So that may be why it's a little bit harder to slice. But mainly I'm cutting this one up so it'll go easier in this little baggie for him. And then she'll be able to give this to him for supper. and she won't have to worry about cooking. Let's just keep on slicing this baby. And she is picking up Trey from school, so she should be here pretty soon with him. Can you see me now? Y'all don't want me to sing, I promise. Okay, Trey's home from school finally, so I can put him to work. Okay. Um, we're gonna make coleslaw to go with our Boston butt. Mm -hmm. I need to wash this real quick. Let me do that. This knife? Yes, okay. I'm not handicapped. All right, well, I'm gonna get it started. Mm, that's very nice. Are you sharp about mine? I, evidently, I did. It's pretty sharp. Oh, I well, you're still gonna cut at it. I'm just getting the core out. All right, so um, Trey is gonna take over, and um, I'm just gonna step aside and let him do his thing. How small? It will, it will chop them to the right size. Okay. You remember you hit the slice shred button. Slice shred. So tell him hi. Hi. Welcome to Making Memories with Mom. I'm here today. Sorry I wasn't here earlier. I had to go to Escuela. And while it's going, you'll push the stuff down. Now, let me see if I have a pusher. A pusher? Mm-hmm. I did, let me see what I did with it. Ah, oh, push here's a pusher. Oh. That way you don't get your fingers. So you use this and you push your cabbage down okay. with that, okay? You don't use your fingers. So how was school? It was good. What was your favorite part? Band. Band? Yes. Almost definitely. 
and also at lunch because my mom made me a wonderful PB&J. I got was my umbrella. <laughs> Genevieve's home. Maybe she can be in our video that we're filming right now. <laughs> and she's escaping. At least I'm here, guys. How's it going, Ty? Oh, it's going great. Good. Did you hear what I said about your PB and J? No. I said it was one of the best parts of my day. Oh, it was so perfect. Yeah. Today. Also, lunch was not good today, so. You what? Lunch was not good today at school, so. Well, I'm glad you had an alternative. This looks like this is about to be sent down the hole of despair. Maybe these could be cut up again. Alright, so we need mayonnaise. Yeah. And I'm looking for the cherries. I think I'm ready to send it, Ma. Alright, yep, looks good. Get this. Yep, go ahead. Okay, so Trey was doing good. He was getting worried about um, his work, but it's actually a perfect texture. <coughs> so that is exactly what we were wanting. He's just never done the feed processor before, so. Okay. I think we are done with the food processor. And look how much progress I've made. So um, we'll come back to you with mom. Okay, so what you're gonna need after we stir it all up and put it in a bowl, you're gonna need three teaspoons of mayonnaise. Tablespoons. 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 Heaping tablespoons. And very big tablespoons. What's your Yeah, anyone can like mayonnaise. It's gross. Um, uh, and then you'll need one tablespoon of sugar. Spread that all out. And then you'll need one quarter of a teaspoon of teaspoon. Teaspoon. Shut up. Sorry. A teaspoon of salt. teaspoon <laughs> of pepper. Okay. Gooey, gooey all over the gooey mooey. Mayonnaise everywhere. So, um, how's your day been? Hope it's been good. Hope it's been bad. Uh, think positive. You'll get better. Don't be sad. It's sad to be sad. Be happy. So we're going to put that in the refrigerator when we get done mixing it um, so that it can sort of congeal, not congeal, it's not, we're not making jello. Chill. We'll say chill. Chill, chill, chill. And then um, I'm going to go get the garlic bread and get it going and then we'll be ready to eat. I'm excited. Oh yeah, we got to make some french fries too. Ooh. All right. So we'll be right back. back. See ya. Well, yeah, I definitely, I definitely want um, garlic bread, but I'm making both, so I need to know what you prefer. Talking to Donnie. He's not mad. He has a hard time making a decision. Takes forever. It's not helping. I guess he's getting garlic bread. 
Actually, I think I'm going to make him a hamburger bun. Whatever you want to do, Ma. We just got all these hamburger buns. So you would be the only one doing garlic bread? Yeah. Okay. You're fine with that. So I'll just not yes, I'm fine with that. And I'm doing a hot dog bun. Oh, yeah, that's right. So good. So deliciously delect. I will have to agree with you. Now, do you want garlic on it, or do you just want, um... Whatever we had at the one supper? Yes, it's... Oh. At the last supper? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I like that for anybody. Something about it. Well, that's okay. We're doing this one anyway. Okay. Um, so I need the butter. Can you... Oh, here it is. Never mind. Sorry. I butter. Butter, butter. Butter, butter, butter. Let's see. This needs to cook at 425. Will you turn it up? 425? Yes, I will. And... It's kind of hard. Oh, it's already hot. There's something yeah, but the temperature needs to go up. Okay. Five to six minutes. Okay. What's in there? 425? That's the meat. It yeah. smells like bacon. 425. It's like Boston, but. Ew, why is it boy? Why is it boy? Leave it alone. Why is it boy? All right, so today has been a fantastic Friday, I must say, and it is so much more fun once the kids get home from school. Um, however, the time that I had today by myself was epic, and I got a lot done, so that was good. Would you get me a butter knife, please, sir? I will. Um, so it was a good day, but then when the kids come home and the husband wakes up, it, <laughs> it gets so much more fun. I can't explain it. I thought so, you were going to take a bite out of this. Do y'all hear that rain? That's rain. If not, we can show them. Come here. Let's do our, um, no, leave it. Let's do our, come on. Look at our, the way we matched. You see what his shirt says? It says, save the earth. Save the earth, plant a tree. That's my boy. <laughs> Thanks, Trey. You're welcome, Mom. Welcome, Katie. Here. You call me Mom. <laughs> so, um, we need to plant a tree this spring. I'm thinking pine tree, because I can get one for free from Aunt Gigi. A little pine thing. tree. I just gotta dig it up. That pine tree out there is too big. So we can't get one like that. Alright, put this in the oven if you. Oh, wait, I need to move that thing aside. Would you grab that and we will go to the oven together? Okay. The phone. You want me to back up the just camera da, 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 da. and turn it this way inside the oven? Oh, we can set it? Yeah. Let yeah, me take it off the side. So we're gonna just move this. Up. Ooh. This butt aside. My booty butt. And put this in for, let's say, three minutes, and then we'll flip it and cook it for another three minutes. Ugh. Egg muscles. And while that's cooking for the first three minutes, I am going to butter, because not everybody likes this um, Texas toast. I do, especially with barbecue. Let me put this back in the freezer real quick. Oh, that wasn't very quick. I'm sorry. I thought I could do it a lot quicker than that. All right, so this is Trey's favorite hot dog bun. Hot dog bun. And it, it really is very good. But I have a specific craving. Do you want two pieces? I'd love two pieces. Okay. All right, so to make homemade garlic bread, the only thing you have to do is slather it with butter. 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 And then you sprinkle it with garlic powder. Now, I have experienced someone who has sprinkled their homemade garlic bread with garlic salt, and it was inedible. Ew. So, please, 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 Use garlic, garlic powder. powder. P-O-W-E-D. 
D E O P O W D E R. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> My sixth grader knows how to spell powder. I'm so proud. I'm sorry. No, you're fine. Really? I, I, I am probably the worst speller in this house. Spell peanut. A P E A N U T. But anyway, I think the reason is because. I live on the computer and every time, every software that I use uh, has a spell check on it. So even my phone, when I'm on Facebook, it checks my spelling. So you never have to spell anything. Right? I never have to think about it. Even though like the other day I put thoroughly and it didn't come out thoroughly. Isn't that ironic? So. <laughs> All right, so here's the garlic powder, and we're just going to sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Remember, there's no salt in this, so. Absolutely right, so zero in salt. In minutes, when that goes off, we'll put these in and let them toast. All right, so we're going to make some french fries real quick in the um, air fryer. These won't be ready right at dinner time, but that's my fault because I was not. Oh my God, they're coming, Mom. Hold on. All right, so I told Trey, he doesn't like Boston butt, so we're going to, with the french fries, we're going to throw in one of these um, chicken breasts. This is butt. That's why I don't like this butt. Chicken breasts. All right. All right, it's almost ready. There's our garlic bread. It's done. So we're just waiting on our french fries to finish. Um, of course, we probably won't wait on those the whole way because Donnie needs to get to work. Um, so let me pull out the, the meat and we'll look at it. All right, let's see what she looks like. Ooh, la, 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 la. You wanna see? Yum, I'm glad I put that juice in there. This is supper. Got garlic bread, Boston butt, french fries, and coleslaw. And I know it's gonna be good, y'all. All right, George, you need to sit right here so I can sit. Thank you, Georgia. All right, so we made it through another fantastic Friday. And I couldn't have done it without you, I'm sure of that. So I appreciate you um, tagging along with me and um, helping me get it done, even though I'm not done, but um, I'm closer than I was this morning. So let's recap how this day went. Um, after very little sleep, I woke up and we did bunches of laundry. I washed all of George's little blankets and we started uh clean, we cleaned out the chicken coop so we got that done i wanted to do that before it started to pour down rain and we cleaned up the porch right yes cleaned up the porch or started that process and um then we had lunch we had a delicious roast leftovers with potatoes and carrots and then we took a nap and that was lovely and that's when it started to rain. So then we started, oh, and I put together a little um, food package for my mom and dad so that when 
she brought Trey home. I could send her home. I ended up sending her home with some Boston butt and some spinach and what else? Oh, some roast, some of that leftover roast. So she was very uh, thankful for that. Um, and then we started our supper and got it going. And supper the kids was delicious. Home. Everybody liked it. We had Boston butt and coleslaw and French fries and um, garlic bread, and it was delicious. Got it cleaned up and put away. And the kids are in their room. Donnie's gone to work. And now it's just me and Georgia, right? Yeah. So I'll probably finish up the laundry and then go relax somewhere and get a good night's sleep. So I really appreciate y'all um, hanging out with me. And um, I really enjoy making these videos. Yes. Um, I hope I can continue to do it. I, I do um, keep a diary. And having this in place of a diary, or in addition to having this is, um, is pretty special for memory's sake. So, hence making memories with mom. All right, guys, I hope y'all have a great evening. I definitely had a fantastic Friday and um, looking forward to tomorrow. Of course, it's gonna be raining still, but we will finish the porch, we'll finish laundry, we'll relax, watch TV, whatever. Whatever we All right, y'all take care, and we'll see you next time.